Hi, I'm Margie. I hope you enjoy this little video we've produced. What is healing all about anyway? Healing is a complicated matter. We all know the formula, when you feel unwell go to the doctor, get a diagnosis, a prescription, drugs and get better. Or not. When you repeat the formula as many times as it takes. Or you eventually die without resolution. Now most of us know, that the formula doesn't work most of the time, and many depart this life without healing. Sad but true. So, in the words of Einstein. Insanity is doing the same thing again and again and expecting a different result. We need to rethink, what true healing is all about. Most of us don't know we are sick, until we get symptoms, pain. The priority is then about relieving the symptoms. Making ourselves comfortable, able to continue with living our life, drugs, painkillers and exploration with machines. But this doesn't get us better. This approach ignores the question, what makes us physically sick in the first place? There are all the standard arguments about bugs, immune systems, accidents, and conditions we have been born with or inherited, this makes us victims, and if you want to go in this direction, who am I to stop you? If on the other hand, you believe, like me, that there is no such thing as a victim, then looking deeper into how we heal, is easy. We aren't, in fact, the lumps of meat the medical profession treats us as. Tackling only the physical animal body, isn't the way to get well. What about the rest of us, the mental, emotional and spiritual aspects of ourselves? Don't they also play a part? Of course they do. We are integrated, multidimensional energetic beings, that are more complicated than the findings on a butcher's slab. As energetic beings, which quantum physicists have proved that we, like all things, are, vibrating energy. Nothing more, nothing less. Therefore, to get well it only makes sense to treat what makes us sick, with energy. This of course isn't anything new or new age. Energy healing is as old as time itself, and if it hadn't had any success, then it would have died out, long long ago. What is new though? Is the vibrational healing received by the QSB, which produces scalar waves in the solfeggio and custom frequencies, that treat not only the physical body, but the mental, emotional and spiritual all at the same time. It shakes the very roots of the disease. The root, is usually in the emotional energetic level, but can be in the mental, and be very hard, if not impossible, to uproot without assistance, this is where the strength of the QSB lies. It shakes away relentlessly, until the soil around the roots of sickness come loose, and can be pulled out and thrown away. This all squashes the victim mentality about being sick. And quite honestly is too much for some people to handle. It is much easier to say life, or someone, had done this to me, and I want you to heal me. So if this is how you feel, stop reading or watching right here. Complete healing can only be done by yourself. You, are in charge of it. Yes, we need help, maybe lots, but it is only that, help. Is there hope? It all sounds so damn difficult. Yes, absolutely, there is superb help. The QSB will do the digging, and will also smooth the way. As long as you are open. 
as long as you truly want wholeness and complete wellness, it will facilitate that. Don't want it, or are half-hearted, the QSB, will still dig, but your resistance to being fully committed to being well, will create its own challenges. There are no compromises to becoming and keeping well. Time to take our power back to heal. Throw away the victim mentality. Stop relying on the unreliable. Get up with the play, and get on with the job of being well. Time for a new paradigm in healing. Time for the QSB. Did you enjoy that? We hope so, because here at Life Energy Designs, we want to educate you so that you can live the best possible life that you can. Any feedback or anything that you want to say to us, we would love to hear from you. Take care.